YouTubies. How's it going? Be careful not to bump the table. <laughs> I don't think they're going to bump our table. Scoot your knee. Give me some room. No, I yeah. wasn't going to share. What? I said no. Mm -hmm. All right, tonight we are having mac and cheese with chicken. Well, it's Velveeta shells and cheese with yeah. chicken in it. It was supposed to be could be a shells and cheese with chicken in it and a side of right chicken flavored rice aroni to go with. But it's not ready yet. Mom's gonna be mom and dad's gonna be home a little bit from church, so we're trying to hurry to eat before they get home. <coughs> and you fell over. Hold that thought. Sorry people. My tripod broke earlier, so I'm like that's just the ASMR part. Improvising here. <laughs> oh, it is, huh? Yep. Them going for a quick tumble. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if this will help or not, but... Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Alright, we're going to try this. Don't and wiggle. I didn't wiggle. I I'm moved just... something. I'm just saying in general, because you always wiggle your knee and stuff. So, <laughs> listen, you guys. Yeah, the, the base of my tripod. I don't know there. why you overturned it. I don't know. What? Can I not see you? Okay. I can't. That's close enough. You got to remember, blind woman trying to navigate here. I know. I thought she wants to see an eye dog. So what I told her I was going to do, I was going to get her a stuffed animal dog, cut off the eyes, and put glasses on it. That way it would be the blind leading the blind. Let's see what I got to deal with. I thought it was really funny. <laughs> uh, so y'all doing? Good, I hope. Pardon if I'm a mess. It's hot as blazes in here. For one thing, Anthony's been cooking, so the kitchen is hot because of cooking. But also, Mom and Dad had the heat up to 78 degrees. And it's only 50 degrees outside. It's like, oh my goodness! <sighs> and I still can't hear. Other than the buzzing that's... <laughs> Hanging here, but not... Not as well as it should. Not normal. Then again, he's, he's not normal. I married not normal. I married not normal. I'm not the one who has a dead twin. <sighs> I better explain that or people are going to be offended. Pe new people. On Ancestry.com Somebody in my family tree accidentally messed up and somehow or another it showed that I had a dead twin named the same exact name as me and the same exact birthday, which would be twin. But I have no twin. I have no siblings. I'm an only child. <laughs> so... And and the dead twin lives in Warsaw, too. Yeah, the, where we live. Yeah, it's kind of strange. <laughs> you say, I had to contact that relative and let them know. I was like, um, I have no twin. No twin died. <laughs> I'm an only child. <laughs> so, when you say they fixed it. They never said a word to me, but yet they fixed it. Sorry, I had two... Predators circling around us. <laughs> Bruce and Diana. Our kitty cats. Mm -hmm. And this is Mountain Lightning, not anything else. So, Yeah, this is the mac and cheese with, he put chicken in it. Usually, I know a lot of people put tuna in it, but he put chicken in it tonight. So, it's good. Canned chicken. It's pretty good this way. Mm hmm. I should like it. I'm, I'm curious to try. Watch those claws with my booty. Ooh. Oh, what he did that for? 
she'll walk by or he'll walk by and grab her butt with his claws. Yeah. Oh, every once in a while. He doesn't do very often, but just enough to catch you off guard. Like, whoa. He's flirting with you. <laughs> it's something. <laughs> now I totally lost my train of thought. Oh, when I was a kid, mom always made mac and cheese with tuna in it. And back then, being a kid and a little bit picky of an eater, I wasn't real picky, like a lot of kids. But on some things, I was picky. So that I didn't like. But I'm curious to try it now as an adult to see how I like it. You know how sometimes your taste buds change? I'll get one of those five cup cans tuna and maybe like one can or box of mac and cheese and mm -mm. I don't think so <laughs> but yeah I don't know why I didn't like it back then so spoiled brat oh. I ate most everything else except for cream corn like I said I overall I was not a picky eater I'm still not a picky eater so now it's still cream corn, candied yams at Thanksgiving. I, I like yams to an extent, except they put so much the syrupy stuff on it and the marshmallows is just too sweet. And there's a couple other little things that I don't like. Yeah, she won't eat canned cat food anymore. <laughs> <laughs> she won't eat baby food anymore. Mm -mm. Is stuff still on? Yes. You want to go ahead and yeah, give it a check. Yeah, I definitely would not eat that stuff no more. Woo. That was so funny watching her do that. It's on video if you want to look for it. Okay, your stuff. You can't pause it. We'll be right back. Not Still now. paused. Now it's playing. It's on. Okay, there it goes. I was making sure. I was looking at the tiny, tiny little numbers because I had to be right up next to them. You couldn't even see those numbers from here. I could see them from here. That's how I was telling you it was on. What did it say? It said 710. Okay. Give me your eyes. Okay. I we, just gave you a dirty look. Hand me the box. Okay. We are now also having... <laughs> Chicken rice and roni to go with our um, mac and cheese. Which is, well, I love chicken rice and roni. Chicken rice and roni, uh, the Velveeta shells and cheese, which is both really good. Yeah. Now all it needs is mashed potatoes. I ain't cooking it <laughs> right now. <laughs> I don't know if we have any She food. hates cooking mac and cheese. She hates cooking rice or roni. I don't know why. I, I don't feel... I know it sounds silly. I don't feel like I'm very good at fixing them. I feel like I always get accidentally get the mac and cheese underdone. Because it requires enough effort to watch it. I watch it. I got where I sometimes fix it for you. Well, I should say I fix it when it's in the little instant cups that you add water and put it in the microwave. Yeah. No effort, kind of. Yeah. Hello. Chronic fatigue. I need stuff as least effort as possible. So, how's your day? It started raining in the middle of the nights, too, lately here. Yeah. Days have been nice. Great nights have been wet. Turn just a teensy bit. Look at me. Yeah. It's a little bit cooler in here than it was earlier, but man, it's still hot. I don't know why my, well, I know why my parents kicked the heat up so high, because they're on blood thinners, but 
wow, it makes it difficult for him and I. Because we're not on blood thinners, so we're in here just like, it feels like a sauna, literally. I give off so much body heat myself that... He literally does. Our old mattress, I wish I got a picture of it. Our old mattress. My parents gave us a, new, a brand new mattress for our bed when we moved in. The old mattress, it was already here when we moved in. The previous person had left it. But, it, even though it was an old mattress, it didn't have a big um, burn spot on it until we moved in. And he laid on it. That was her farts. No. <laughs> He put off so much heat, uh, as always, that he had a big old, like, square from where his back, and you lay on his back, and then on the edges of the bed, where he has his arms laying over, it had singe marks all over. I wish I got a picture of it, because <laughs> I could actually usually feel the heat coming off him, especially one time when we was at Walmart, and a Walmart employee... Um, didn't do things correctly on a return. Pissed Anthony off. Oh my God. The heat that came off of him because he got so mad. I was pissed. And she could tell it. Yeah. But he doesn't even have to be mad for heat to come off of him. It's just his natural thing. Oh. But man, I wish I got a picture of that mattress before we burned it. <laughs> Hmm. Any other time, I take pictures of practically everything. And I forgot to that time. It's really, <coughs> really funny is how I would get out of things. And she couldn't figure it out T how. Speeding tickets and all that kind of stuff. I mean, I got pulled over once. Expired plates. No insurance. No driver's license. Everything. This was like 27 years ago. Everything was expired. And the cop it's like, okay, you can go. Not even joking. I, I still to this day do not know how he managed to get out of all that when all that list of stuff was against him. Like, wow. Talk about luck something but crazy of course if it was me no I got pulled over for, for speeding which I still to this day do not think I was actually speeding but I didn't know better to that I could actually see the um, cops speed gun or what do you call it to see it for, for myself so I got a speeding ticket. I was only like 10 miles over or something like that, but still. I like the time when we were still dating, going to Green Top. I was doing over 100 miles an hour going over these hills. And then it's like, oh man, I got a funny feeling. Slow down. I just crossed the top of the hill and there's a cop sitting there with his radar gun, waning. It's like, well, somebody obviously called him, and I got slowed down just two times. <laughs> I swear, particularly, he still has it, but particularly back when he was younger, he had a cop radar in his head. <laughs> you know, that sixth sense sort of thing. Not me, though. Hmm. <laughs> This is getting to be filling already. Yeah, as I say, if we didn't fix so much already and it was so filling, vegetables would have been good. Yeah. Well, that's the thing about these two dishes. They're both very filling. Stick to your ribs sort of food. Well, chicken mac and cheese. Oh, that's what that is. Yeah, I got too much sticking to my ribs. Oh, the other funny thing is, I don't know how she does it, but with mattresses and blankets and stuff, 
they migrate to her side. Yeah, he thinks I'm a bed and blanket hog. We'll have them. We got a king size blanket in the bedroom. That's you, our bottom blanket, you know, to lay on because it's really comfortable. Soft. Oh. Snuggly. We'll have the edge right to the edge on her side. <gasps> in about four days, it's on almost her. the whole blanket is on her side. Seriously. A couple of days later, if I didn't pull it over, I wouldn't have a blanket. <laughs> He'd be like, well, the mattress itself. If it wasn't for the fact that you steal the mattress somehow, too. I don't know how. Somehow, when I get up, I the mattress moves over to my side as well. But yet, I will admit, when it comes to the top blankets, he's a blanket thief. I have to actually... Don't give me that look. You know you are. Uh -huh. a, couple, a couple times I've actually had it. Well, actually, most of the time, if we're sharing a blanket, I have to lift the blanket up, lift my body up, lay my body on the blanket so it has weight on that, you know, She edge. does that anyways. She no. steals the blankets. No, I don't do that because usually it gets hot. But I want to make sure I have a blanket. Yeah. The reason she gets hot, and then she kicks the blanket off and blames me for stealing it. You kick the blanket off, too. He usually doesn't sleep with a blanket. Except occasionally here lately because it'd be in winter. Which is weird. It's hot during the day and evenings in the house because mom and dad have the, hate, the heat cranked. The hate cranked. <laughs> yeah. That's what I will say. The heat cranked. But yet, at nighttime sometimes, depending on the um, temperature outside, our bedroom gets cold. So, like, then again, we have the um, vent covered in our bedroom, too, so that we don't get all that heat. So, it keeps it cooler in there. So, yeah, last thing we need is all that hate coming in. <laughs> right? <laughs> don't want that. <clears throat> Don't you love how sometimes your brain and mouth don't want do not do not want to cooperate? See, perfect example right there. What? I didn't say anything. Yeah, what were you doing with your hand? I'm holding my fork. <laughs> That's not what you were doing. You were doing something. I'm being ornery. I'm never ornery. I'm sweet and innocent. You're always ornery in a bad way. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Or, yeah. Something. I'm brain part now. Mm-hmm. Your mouth and brain don't cooperate. Not always. Apparently I used to, but not always. Hmm. About done? Yeah. Because I'm getting stuffed. <laughs> All right. I think we're getting ready to scoop thin. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell. While I'm thinking of it, I want to thank all of you guys for sending that they had sent us messages inquiring what happened to us, if we're still alive, if we're, you know, how we're, if we're still going to be doing videos, and all this kind of stuff. Just you stuck the life force out of me. <laughs> it just, like we said in one of our previous videos, just been life catching up with us and just being very discouraging and depressing so and we have was having a rough time with things so i'm done first well then eat mine merry christmas <laughs> so yeah so we're trying to get back in the swing of doing videos so working on it i've been have, getting lots of exercise too I'm not chopping trees. <laughs> Video game, but well. Yeah, that doesn't don't expect count. Me to do that for real. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't count. So, but um, something else I was gonna say. I forgot what I was gonna say. Yeah, that's my train of thought. You had a train. You had a thought. I did. I lost it. So, anywho, if 
I think of it, I'll tell you guys in the next video, I guess. So, bye bye. She'll forget by then. Probably. I do it all the time. <laughs> bye bye, guys.